keys, wallets, and transactions. To use Bitcoin, you will use a set of keys that can be loosely described as your credentials on the network. These keys are what give access to your transactions and your Bitcoins. To put it simply, in order to receive Bitcoins, you need a public key, and in order to spend Bitcoins, you need a private key. Wallets and Addresses The Bitcoin wallet is your gateway to the Bitcoin network. This is the software that will allow you to send and receive Bitcoin. One of the functions of the wallet is to allow you to generate addresses, which are sort of disposable public keys. Bitcoin addresses look like this. The wallet, using the public key, also keeps track of all of your tokens, allowing you to view your Bitcoin balance. Your private key is generated by your wallet and exists as a set of words that you should write down on a piece of paper and keep somewhere safe. Types of Wallets There are several types of wallets. Mobile wallets, desktop wallets that you install on your computer, wallets integrated directly into exchanges, as well as hardware wallets. There are also hot wallets and cold wallets. A hot wallet is a wallet whose keys are stored on a device with internet access. Cold storage refers instead to keys that were generated on a device not connected to the internet. Sending and receiving Bitcoins To receive Bitcoins, you simply generate an address using your wallet and share that address with the person who wants to send them to you. To send Bitcoins, simply use the send function in your wallet and use the recipient's Bitcoin address. Strategies for keeping private keys If there is one topic in Bitcoin that should not be taken lightly, it's the process of backing up your private keys. When creating your wallet, you will be prompted to write down a series of 12 or 24 words that make up your private key. This is the closest we can get to, quote, touching or seeing Bitcoins. These words allow you to retrieve access to your Bitcoins using any wallet that supports this standard. It is important to, one, write down each word clearly on a piece of paper. Two, do not store these words electronically. Three, do not take pictures or screenshots of these words. Four, do not write these words down in a file on your computer. Five, do not store these words on an online service. Make two copies by hand of these words and keep them in a safe place. You can also carve these words into a metal plate in order to prevent water or fire damage.